Hello again, it's Priscilla Batzell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery in the backyard. And I have a conundrum. I keep forgetting my glasses in the house, but I'm doing simple stuff, so it shouldn't be too hard, hopefully, to guess what's going on. I'm going to use, what I've been using is black on white, or white on black, or even gold on black. And this time I want to take my enamel, oh boy, and do something similar. Just like I would if I were going to be covering a canvas with paint to start priming it, which could be any old configuration. Only this time I'm going to be filling in with gold and or white and swiping and I'll see how I feel about it. I think I'm going to use this um, Anita's metallic white. I don't want to cross over. I do kind of want to cross over actually. Let's do one more. I could do other colors. I'm not sure how much paint I can get away with and I, I'm so desiring to do this in rainbow configurations. Now, I've been using my large OXO omelet turning spatula available on the Amazon link underneath the link tree, but I think what I'm going to do this time is use my Princeton Art Tool Catalyst spatula, and if I don't like what I get, I'll do something else about it. Because I have a certain level of confidence that I can usually figure out something to do. Almost anything. It's not really a geometric. And I am just dragging the spatula through things, making a graphic design sort of thing. I'm also perfectly willing to pick up paint from one place and put it down in another, like so. And if I don't think it's good enough, I'll just do something with it tomorrow. Add more paint or something. And I do use GAC 800 by Golden, so where the paint is heavy, I can actually get away with saving it. I could just keep playing with this. I kind of want to pull the basting brush out, but I haven't really finished experimenting all the ways I feel like I could doing what I'm doing and I just want to I just kind of sort of want to start by experimenting with the spatulas and then move along to something else I can always pick up paint like I said and put it down somewhere else especially if there are puddles of paint Because they often look like, not just like grids, but they look like um, aerial views of things. I'm very tempted to just continue on having a good time until I start to be unhappy, but it makes it difficult without the glasses. It also makes me want to try more things, like to put more gold down and then to swipe across and see what happens. And I don't have to just put gold down. I could put the white down where the black is and the black where the white is and all of that. So maybe I'll do that. And I am using the black enamel, which is sort of an expensive fix. Not what I would usually do, but I thought I might make some cells. Just going up and down wherever the mood strikes me. It has got a kind of a 50s, 60s vibe to it. So I hadn't put any dots in anything yet. I also hadn't gone ahead and used uh, a skewer or anything. 
It's kind of cool. I've got some cells. I don't mind that. I am filling up the space a little bit more than I was anticipating, but there's more white can canvases and I know how to use them. It's definitely not plaid. Not sure what it is. Doesn't keep me from wanting to swipe though. I'll have a screenshot for, for a memory if I swipe. That's about it. I think I'll just keep playing. Because that's where the fun is. And I want to make sure that um, my OCD personality disorder is uh, not gonna is gonna allow me to be, be creative and a little outside the box, as opposed to what could happen, which is I freak out because there's too many angles that are not angles, if you know what I mean. I'm really actually having some fun, even though I don't have my glasses, which is kind of freaking me out a little bit. But uh, I can see well enough from where I am, I guess. It's a little fuzzy. And I don't mind mixing the black with the gold. Or the white. And I am having way more fun than I anticipated at this stage. Because I thought I was maybe going too far. I'm going to steal a little black paint and go over here. And I guess, in a way, it's a geometric, but I'm not sure I would feel totally comfortable calling it that. It definitely has that city street feel to me again. Or I don't know what. See, anywhere where the paint is heavy gives me permission to go ahead and dip right in. When I run out, I'll dip in again. Do I have enough gold on this side? I kind of think I do. That's a little white pearl. That's the metallic from Anita's. I think I'm done. Um, just because this is a very quick process doesn't mean it's not done because <laughs> it's feeling done to me. So I'm going to tell you guys, this is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. Still experimenting with uh, squeeze bottles and enamels and cells and gold and black. And uh, Thank you for joining me. Thank you for the thumbs up. Thank you for sharing my videos. There's over 1,450 videos right now. You can find them all organized by the hundred and by playlist, excuse me, by yes, by playlist, uh, by the genre and by topic, if you're looking for them. I'm pretty sure I like this. I just keep wanting to take my, my skewer and look for some paint and add a few dots though because I think I really have a thing for dots. They just do something for me. They add a whole new element, really. And it's the dull end of the skewer that makes them the right size and picks up the right amount of paint. And I'm kind of glad I did that, because I'm really liking them. And you can have one, or a few, or as many as you want, really. So it's very graphic. And I'm really glad you guys joined me. There's 87,000 subscribers on my channel. If you're interested in watching some pouring that doesn't have commercials, go check out Phoenix Rising for Syllabat Cell Art. Until I get a thousand people there and uh, two thousand out watch hours, I won't have any commercials. And it's a ways away, believe me, because there's only 500 subscribers there and uh, 400 hours of watch time. It's a pretty new channel. I don't know how much more gold I want to add, but I'm kind of glad I added the gold and I don't mind having a little bit of black in there. It bothers me a little bit when my my lines are so off. I don't think I want to do anymore. 
So I'm going to tell you guys I love you and uh, check out the Teespring clothing below the video. And that is got Oliver print leggings and Oliver print t-shirts. And that one thing was bothering me. And everything else is pretty good. Yep, I'm happier now. This is fun. I'm not saying there isn't a point at which you might think that you have gone too far. But you can go a lot less far and still have a lot of fun just playing. Because it's abstract expressionist art with fluid acrylics. So what did I not tell you? I, I do sell my artwork and I give lessons at the house and my email address is below the, the link tree below the video. Also below the video you will find my paint pouring recipe. On the link tree you'll find Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links, uh, my website, uh, my Google business page where you could leave a review if you want to. And uh, just know that when you shop my Amazon link it's at no added cost to you and it helps me out. And should you want to be included in the monthly drawing you should check out the video on the end screens of any video and it will show you what that exhibition video is all about and it will also tell you what the month what that particular month's drawing prizes are yes I did <laughs> I did just do that and I'm gonna stop playing now and I'm gonna torch to release the bubbles in the paint not that there should be too many of them because whenever I swipe I got the feeling but then there's quite a bit right straight out of the bottle don't forget GAC 800 by Golden will keep your paint from cracking if it's heavy at least to a point I did do something the other day out of the, out of a thousand pieces I finally got an indentation you guys take care of yourselves take care of each other and uh, make sure you look on the community board for today's video because I usually post that right around midnight and uh, I love you guys take care of yourselves I said that take care of each other and I will see you in on. This is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. Out. Bye for now.